What's up YouTube, this is Sada Mintas and this is my unboxing on the Billion Bipack 8800NL Wireless N VDSL Fiber ADSL Plus 2 Fiber Router. So I'm not going to go into massive specs right now because I know it bores a lot of you guys a really lot and you think I'm crazy. So yeah, let's get over some specs really, really quick. So I'm actually speaking in an overcast video, so I'm not actually speaking in the video. I'm just going to show you whilst I'm talking. So this route largely complies with a lot of the ADSL and BDSL compliance, which is um, just a put of few. There. There's you know Annex A, Annex B, and Annex N compatible. Um, for the VDSL, it, it supports Vectoran and it supports GHS, so that's good. Um, it has IP4 and IPv6 dual stacking modes. It has NAT static routed modes. It has a lot of uh, stuff that you would need for a uh, moderately small enterprise or an SOHC, I'm pretty sure it's called. Um, no, SOHO user, which is basically a business user or a home user. So yeah, it supports a lot of good stuff that you would need. And just the cost effective of this router, makes it very very tempting to buy i mean it's about 60 pound in britain versus something like a um a higher-end brand that's more towards that's three four hundred pounds for the same sort of equipment so yeah this route for one does destroy many other companies routers i mean it's got an snr modulated uh gui so you can adjust your snr for one that's one good thing about it for people with a slow broadband you can roughly get about two more meg at your line. Um, that's one of the good things. Two is cheap. Um, three, it's very, very easy to use. Once it's all set up, I mean, it's not really going to fail on you. I mean, <laughs> it's very simple to set up. It's got a lot of manuals. It's got a lot of warranty in it. It's got a lot of a lot of security good stuff on it. So you're not going to get any trouble right there. Um, for the wireless, it's very basic. I mean, you just got 2.4 gigahertz band. You know, it's up to 300 megahertz operational rate. You got wireless protected setup, so you just press a button, it just selects your policy. You know, it's just nothing too complicated for the minor person who doesn't know much about networking. Um, it has a onboard USB applicated server, so you actually put your uh, media servers onto it through USB. Uh, for the management, it's got an easy, easy SO sign on, which is you know, the GUI. Um, it's got an on based, web based GUI remote control lo uh, local management, what I just said then. Uh, for firmware upgrades, it does very easy upgrades. You just select it from the website, download it, put it into the firmware upgrade, job done. For the hardware side of it, I'm not going to go into it because it's very, very complicated now and again. And yeah, so if you want to hear more about this tutorial, I will make a full out tutorial on, you know, what Azure can do. I'll give you the exact specs of mine and show exactly what I do, how to adjust your SNR, how to get better speeds, how to do fiber connections to it and all the other stuff that you need to know that you want to get better so if you like the video guys thumbs up don't like a thumbs down and remember guys thanks for watching sergeant and mean out have a good day and thank you for watching goodbye now